And most married people, when they argue, I bet you 80% of their arguments are about 20% of the topics. Um, could be, and money. Money's the could typical be one. Money, kids, it could be um, kids. Yeah. Um, intimacy. I was going to say yeah. bopping in the beater. Yeah, yeah. Always it could be, it's yeah, money, head, parenting, it? and intimacy. Yeah. Those are probably the three key areas that people have the biggest so-called fights, right, arguments, right. discussion. Well, if you could, and what are the fights usually about? I bet you if you recursively 80-20 that and go, okay, there's a, a thing that's related to parenting. And it's going to be a recurrent theme. There is probably only 10, 20% of that topic that's that worth you talking really about. are fundamentally disagreeing yeah. on and so you could use mike's example of chunking up what is this that we both want well i want this and i want this okay. what are they both what examples, are they both of? examples yeah. of we want our kids to be well adjusted let's say okay great how can we both agree on that and then now move back down the tree yes. into the thing that we can agree on the details of it right yes. so find that big picture so 20 percent of the problems that you have 20 percent of those problems are probably the things you actually disagree on and can probably resolve with a little bit of creative thinking right right and then yes. your life gets better way better <laughs> 